Welcome to Spit Buckets, here again at Gambaro's, and today we have a quick brown bag episode. Basically where... You grew up with brown bag, widened brown bags, didn't you? <laughs> You've been waiting all day to say that, seriously, all day. <laughs> Takes you back to your past, recent past. Okay, what, so what, what have you done to me? What are you, what are you doing? What I'm doing is, I have a wine here, and I want to see what you... I'm not asking you to pick what it is, or anything regions, or anything like that. Just tell, like what I'm aiming at is for you to tell me what you think of this wine, quality wise, where it sits, um, some idea of what you think people pay. It could be anything from a $6 wine to a $200 wine. Seriously? Absolutely. Nothing but the best for you. Well, the six bucks is half a chance you paid for it. Totally ridiculous. You're going to have some as well? Of course. I'll, have to, I'll be honest, I haven't tried this, this particular wine. You haven't tried it? I haven't tried this particular wine. No, is it? Classic Australian red. And we're we're on track so far. Are we? Yeah, we are. Seriously, doesn't know this. Fucking, yeah, it takes me back to my, to my dad's claret that he used to bring up. That is a nice. I quite enjoy that. Mm -hmm. It's got length. It's got depth. It's got. Some lovely licorice. No, it's, in there. it's got that big, dark, rich black chocolate. Yeah. Um, it hangs around. There's no, there's no bumps or. It's, a, it's a seamless style. Mm. It's quite, it's quite a plush sort of soft, soft, lingering style. Although I'm not supposed to. You're supposed to be telling so me. It's got some nice. It's got some grippy tannins there. It's a bit there. Yeah. Mm. But I do like that chocolate, that chocolate note to it. I do like that. That licorice aspect. I love the the length of it. It just keeps going on and on and it on does, and on and on. Amazing length. That is just it's intense. Mm -hmm. It's an intense wine. See the trick of course would be to put on a two hundred dollar wine, have you bag it or put on a six dollar wine and uh, have you love it one or the other. Or somewhere in the middle. Well see I'd I'd be more than happy to pay I know, 35 40 for that. If you're happy to pay 35 40 means most of the rest of the world would pay 60 or 70 wouldn't they? <laughs> well, don't keep me in suspense. What is it? Yellow tail. Fair dinkum. It's the, it's the reserve yellow tail Shiraz. Do they have a reserve? Yep, they do. 15 bucks. That's a bargain. Absolutely. 15 bucks for that. And you can see why people love the stuff. Well, hang on, I've had Yellow Tail, not the Reserve, and I had it in New York, and let me tell you, it was... Well, I didn't like it. There are other Yellow Tails. Um, but I've never had the Reserve. No. What makes it a Reserve? I mean, why? Why is it a Reserve? Oh, they would presumably... You don't know, do you? If you'd allow me to finish... Yellow tail, if you'd like to let Ken know. <laughs> no, that, email no, it's, 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 it's obviously spent a bit more time in oak or better quality oak or these are these are better quality grapes that they've put in. That's really good. Um, I actually quite enjoyed that. Absolutely. I mean, there's, Did it surprise you when you first tried them? Um, look, they won a Jimmy Watson a few years ago, so you know that they're producing some stuff, top-notch stuff somewhere. Are, are you a fan of the, of, the, of, the, of the standard stuff? You couldn't be, Ken. I mean, I'm not. I mean, you couldn't be. Could you? I mean, I mean, for what it is, it, it is. It's what, a great export it's, label, it's, whatever it is. It's isn't done it? fantastically well. It's, it, it's, but it's drinking, it, not thinking stuff. It's, it's, it's got a thinness to it, which I've never yep. quite enjoyed. This doesn't. It, this it, is. It tends to have that sort of a bit level of extra level of uh, residual sweetness in it. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Again, this this is actually. This is a cracker. Got, got quite intense flavours. Um, you couldn't complain. At Fifteen bucks. That is um, fifteen bucks. I've just um, I've just found a, a new wine as our house wine on the deck. I think, for 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 ourselves. Uh, well, I think it just it just especially we got a situation. Obviously, we have a lot of guys coming around on the deck, etc. Freeloaders, for use of a better term, freeloaders. Um, <laughs> from up. the bathhouse to the deck. <laughs> freeloaders, perfect wine. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Actually, thank you for introducing me to the it, 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 you couldn't, I mean, Yellow Tail there Reserve. There is not much I had out no there idea. at fifteen buck or fourteen ninety nine. There is not much out there at that price. Not with that level of weight and intensity. No. On the pallet. That that is no. a revelation. Stunning. Well done, mate. We spit. 
You don't so have you to. don't have to. 